Yo, 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 what is going on people and welcome back to another FIFA 20 squad builder on this channel and in today's video I'm going to be showcasing the best 200k hybrid, the best 200k team right now in FIFA 20, this 200k team is absolutely insane and most importantly it will do complete damage in foot champions and in division rivals but before I do go ahead and jump into a game and show you guys what this team actually is and the custom tactics and the playing instructions and all that good stuff make sure you guys do go ahead and smash that like button if you guys are enjoying the content so far and if you guys are new around here then why not go ahead and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you guys never miss an upload but without further ado enough of me waffling let's go ahead and get into the video baby let's get it let's go <laughs> Okay guys, so this is the team. This is one of the best 200k teams in FIFA 20 This is the team that you guys are seeing right now on your screens. We've got an insane team We've got the likes of Mertens, Douglas, Costa, Bellarabi, um, Inform, Kimmich, Insigne, Allen, Akanji, Hernandez, and Barbu, Berkey, Dalbert, Douglas, Costa. This whole team is literally so sweaty and literally insane So I do recommend that you guys go ahead and pick up this team But I don't want to spend too much time talking about the players because I know you guys want to see some gameplay So before I do go ahead and get into this division right game i'm gonna quickly show you guys the custom tactics and playing structures and the formation that i actually use because i don't use this formation with this team um so yeah i want to show you all that good stuff so as you guys can see um we're playing the 4-2-3-1 formation this is um, how we're going to structure the team um Dries Martens up top lorenzo and at cam douglas costa left cam um inform bellarabi at right cam right dm allen left dm kimmich and of course the defensive line will stay the same and for the tactics this is the tactics that i use you guys may want to use these tactics as well but as you guys can see in the defensive style we've got pressure on heavy touch um five bars of width three bars of depth and then for the defensive style we've got possession um five bars of width four plays in the box and two corners two free kicks um i really do like these playing instructions uh, not these playing instructions and these custom tactics because i feel like they work for the way i play um for the way i play and i just think they're very very overpowered in this game and for the play instructions this is the play instructions for um the raise mertens as you guys can see um he's got stay central getting behind and stay forward um for lorenzo and senior he's got just on stay forward and that's it for the two dms cut passing line i'm um, the foot sorry for the right cdm which is allen you're gonna have cut passing lines and then cover center and leave it on balanced attack and then for kim which you want to stay back while attacking um cut passing lines and cover center and then for the two wide players you literally just want to leave them on what they are already and then for the two two full backs you're gonna have stay back while attacking so they are the playing instructions they are the custom tactics and now i've done enough talking and i'm pretty sure that you guys want to see the gameplay so without further ado Let's go ahead and jump into this Division Rivals gameplay, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. Okay, guys, this is his team, as you guys can see right now. He's got Gareth Bell, Suarez, Fakir, Ramos, Jordi, Alba, Frankie De Jong, and some other good players as well. It's not a bad team at all. Pretty overpowered, pretty sweaty. But, man, this team is insane, and I'm pretty sure we can take away the win. So, without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and get into this game, man. Downline. Play to Costa. Love that, my boy. Drive. Drive, son. Oh, it's a good tackle from Roberto. How is he catching up to Douglas Costa? Don't trigger me, man. Don't trigger me. Not today. Press, press. Love that, Kimmich. There we go. The pressure on Harry touches there. And then Mertens with a finesse shot. No, what was that? Why was it so tame? Why was it so tame? Did I shoot too early? I don't know. But why was it so tame? No, that was a chance. We had a chance there. Oh, how's he got that through? Get that way. What the hell? No way. What a no. No. No way have we just conceded, bros. Straight down the other end. We just missed that opportunity. Drive, son. Drive. Play him. Douglas Costa, you're there, bro. Play back to him. Love that. Where's the support, Alan? There you go, son. To Insigne. Insigne with a finesse shot. Oh, my days. He's got pushed over. Ref, give me a pen. Give me something, man. That's a foul. Surely. Love that, Kanji. You beast, bro. Senior looks for the run of Mertens. Finds his run. Mertens tries to cut in and Jimenez is there. You read it well. Fair play to my opponent. Can we win it back though? Yes, we do with Allen. We got one last attack before half time. Insigne to Mertens. 
about to Insigne, Insigne with a shot, Insigne with a goal, let's get it, let's go baby, come on, and we have just equalised just before half time, and that is deserved, we were pressuring him, and there we have it man, Lorenzo Insigne, the nimble, the pacey player, and also he is very, very clinical in this game, on his weaker left foot, he manages to score, and we do make it 1-1, that is deserved, come on baby. Douglas Costa, cuts inside, plays Kimmich, Kimmich to Allen, Allen. Into his better rugby, better rugby, draws it into Insigne, Insigne with the skill moves, oh the fake shot was just a bit too heavy but he wins it back high and now Allen's there in and around the box, back to better rugby, back to um, better rugby again and to Kimmich and to Douglas Costa, no, it's still alive, bang it son, oh my days and there it is just over the bar and out wide, oh my days, we're getting close there, we're getting close to that second goal. Whoa. Oh my days, what just happened? I honestly did not... I don't know why the game keeps doing that. Like, that's just not where I passed it. But jeez Louise, how did he miss that? I don't think he expected that either. I didn't, but we can a break now. We can go on the attack. Here we go. Bella Robbie cuts inside. Plays to Insigne to Allen. Insigne to Mertens. Oh, that was meant for Allen. I'm not going to lie to you. Here we go. On the attack now. Insigne. Can we break? Insigne looks for the pass. Oh my days, what a beautiful pass. And Mertens is few. Mertens with a ball roll. Oh my days. No, I should have just shot, but it was just on my back. I wanted to get away from the defender and then finish it. Oh, but what a pass that was from Insigne. But we, the attack's still on here. Here we go now with Douglas Costa. Douglas Costa driving. Douglas Costa driving. Oh, he gets tackled. Unlucky. Oh, we really should have scored there. We really should have scored. What a pass that was from Insigne. Here we go. Douglas Costa. Oh, brilliant piece of skill. You love to see it. And again, son. That's beautiful. Drive now. Drive down line now. Drive. How is how is Sergio Roberto catching up? Someone please tell me. How? Insigne gets a bit lucky there. Cuts it back to Mertens. Mertens, surely now. Surely now. And there you go. Thank you. 2-1. I'm not going to lie. I don't know how Sergio Roberto was catching up to 94 pace. Douglas Costa there. That doesn't make sense. We did get lucky um, with the bounce, but with the bounce back though but you know what i'll take it i'll take it because i don't know how sergio roberto is catching up to douglas costa but it was deserved anyway we've honestly been on top this second half and it is really really deserved but 2-1 and we do take the lead here we go now mertens and insigne plays it to inform better Robbie. and now inform better lb he's driving he's driving he sees douglas costa back post he's going to try pass it to him but it goes to mertens instead and there we go we've got another goal yet again and it's three's mertens on the score sheet and that was a much better goal than the second one that i did score a beautiful from inform better Robbie. brilliant play waiting for the run from douglas costa and mertens and he picks out mertens with a beautiful pass 3-1 75th minute and surely now that is the game still done and dusted Brilliant tackle from Hernandez, brilliant defending there from the centre-back. Honestly, so overpowered in this game. And now can we break from it? That's the question. He's exposed now. He's trying to come back in the game. He's going to attack him. Insigne to Douglas Costa. Back to Mertens, to Douglas Costa, to Mertens, to Costa. Back to Mertens. Oh, what a goal. That's absolutely beautiful. Exquisite. It's just beautiful stuff. 4-1. What a goal that was. Beautiful tiki-taka play. Beautiful interchanging between Dries Mertens and Douglas Costa. And I'm pretty sure that is Mertens' hat trick. But honestly, what an insane goal that was to make it 4-1. Absolutely beautiful. Go ahead and give this video a smash um a, a like for that, for that goal, man. Because honestly, that was absolutely insane, man. That was brilliant. And there you have it guys, that is the end of the game and what a game it was, we did go 1-0 down, but you know what, I kept my cool, I stayed composed because I knew we were on top and I knew we could win this game with one of the best 200k teams in FIFA 20 man, but honestly, our final goal, our fourth goal to get Mertens' hat trick was honestly just beautiful, you guys have just smashed the like button of this video for that man, because that was a beautiful passing play between the strikers, but overall, apart from I think it was our second goal, I think all our goals were very, very nice, um, so yeah man, honestly, I do recommend that you guys go ahead and get this team it is an overpowered team and it will do damage in foot champions and individual rivals man but honestly a fun team to play with a sweaty team you know you've got the likes of Insigne small and nimble the same with Mertens small and nimble um you also got um who else Douglas Costa Insigne Mertens yeah all of them man honestly just so insane and inform Bella Rabi as well but overall a fantastic team performance and yeah man I'm gonna quickly show you guys the team again just so you guys can get another look at it and then I will end the video after that 
Okay, so back to the team and obviously man, a brilliant team performance and like I said man, we got some nimble quick plays in this game like Lorenzo and Insigne as you guys can see there. He's got 94 agility, 90 dribbling, um, 83 composure, 93 ball control and 78 long pass but if you guys did see that long pass that he did to um, put uh, Mertens through on goal, that was an amazing pass. I think his passing as you guys saw there is much better than 70. He's got good short passing as well, his finishing in my opinion does feel a lot better than that. Um, um, as you guys can see he's got 77 finishing but he scored a good goal and in my opinion overall I do think that his shooting is um, a lot better than that he's also quite fast nimble and yeah man and that's the same for um, Mertens as well they do feel quite similar I feel like um, Insigne is a bit more nimble um, and quick at turning than Mertens but Mertens still is very very quick at it I think um, Insigne just edges it just a little bit because they they are quite similar in my opinion I think that Mertens finishing obviously um, as you guys can see there he's got 86 finishing and and uh, we can see that in game and he got a hat trick um he positioned himself as well um he positioned he positioned himself well as well is what i meant to say um if you guys remember that last goal we did score where bella rabi just crossed it into him that was a good run from him and yeah man a good performance from him but overall this team this team is overpowered bros this team is very overpowered and i promise you it will do you damage and foot champions and in division rivals and also man may i just say Oh, Akanji, Akanji is just overpowered in this game, man. He literally feels like a, a more high-rated centre back. He just feels so dominant in that position. He's strong, good at standing tackle, um, and very, very fast as well for a centre back. And that's the same with Hernandez. So these two as a partnership work very, very well. And of course, Allen and Kimmich in the midfield did work well as well. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And look, I think that's EA trying to tell me there that I should end the video now. I just lost my connection to the EA servers. But if you guys did enjoy this video then make sure you guys do go ahead and smash that like button also if you guys are new around here and watching this video then make sure you guys do go ahead and subscribe and turn on post notifications because it is much appreciated but i hope you guys did enjoy enjoy this video most importantly i hope you guys do go ahead and buy this 200k team because it is absolutely insane but it's been your boy rb plays enough from me and i'll catch you in the next one peace out baby